Hello everybody and welcome to our new Friday series of Persona 5 Royal. Now you're probably wondering, why am I calling this the Friday series when this video is going up on a Saturday? Well, I wanted to get a video out on this as soon as possible. Of course, you know, the day I already had the finale for Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door coming up. The original plan was I would come back from work and record the episode. Unfortunately, some problems with my truck uh, caused me to have to go to a mechanic. Now, the mechanic said they'd call me back in about an hour after I had dropped it off, tell me no, let me know what would happen. So I wanted to wait around because I didn't want to have them calling me in the middle of my recording. They ended up not calling, and I ended up having to or I, by the time they didn't call, because I'd already been up since 9pm the day beforehand, I was too tired to record. Hence why this episode is going up Saturday and not on Friday. So I'm not changing up my upload schedule, it's staying the same Monday through Friday. And, um, this is just an oddity caused by unfortunate circumstances. So from now on, this episode is going up or these episodes are going up on Friday at their usual time. I, again, just wanted to get a video out on this as soon as possible while it was still fresh. But anyways, Persona 5 Royal, the definitive edition of Persona 5, and a game that has made some massive improvements from the original. Though, for those of you who have not played this, but have played Persona 5, if you're expecting any major changes in the story from the original, <clears throat> certain palace arc, don't. There are some changes to the main story that are improvements. But I can't get into that without spoiling anything. Now, before we get into the game, I just want to point out. They actually changed the mouse cursor into a nice little dagger. Nothing special about that, I just wanted to point that out. Anyways, without further ado, let us start the game. Yes, I will be playing with English voice language. Yes, thing can be changed later, I don't care. This story is a work of fiction. Similarities between characters or events to persons living or dead in your world are purely coincidental. Ooh, this reminds me, something I almost forgot. But, as is usual when I start a new series, please let me know if there's anything in the audio that is too loud or too quiet. Thankfully, because this is a PC port, I actually have multiple audio sliders to work with, so I can do what I can to fix it. Just let me know. Only those who have agreed to the above have the privilege of partaking in this game. I do not agree! I see. Everything that happens from here on in is real. Is that your cognition of this? Then unfortunately, I cannot allow you to partake of this game. I must ask that you leave. Yep, send you back to the title screen. Alright, let's try that again. Oh, and as is usual with these Persona games, because there is a lot of talking, a lot of cutscenes, and there are going to be moments where you do not have control and don't have the option to save, these episodes are going to be longer than usual. This story. Come on, we get through this. Only the. I agree. The contract. The world. Blah blah blah. Whoops. Those who oppose fate and desire change. From time to time, they were referred to as tricksters. You are the trickster. Now is the time to rise against the abyss of distortion. Alrighty then. Starting off strong with a casino, eh?
Someone's here. Moving immediately. Good. Now get running! This is our only chance! Stay calm. You can get away now. We'll retrieve the briefcase on our end. Hmm? What was that? Don't worry about us. Just concentrate on getting away. Sure, and you might have noticed that there was already a quality of life change. The ability to toggle auto on and off. That's going to be very handy. Anyways. Showing yourself above that crowd earlier was an excellent move. Nice work as always, Joker. I bet Skull wouldn't pull it off that smoothly. This happens because you have no sense for aesthetics. Nobody asked you, Inari! Eh, you're just upset because he's right. There he is! Just run! Get out of there! Okay, the enemy's focus is on... Everyone remember where we're meeting up? No worries, I can guide you all. Yeah, you gotta be careful in this opening bit or you'll miss out on some dialogue. Hey, what you... Stop right you there! Get away. Take him down, Joker! Oh, you have no idea. Go down. Now, nah, I'm not going to go over this because the game is already going to heavily tutorialize this game as is, so I'm just going to explain them as they get explained in game. And let's just blow them away with our gun. Too slow. Joker behind you. Go through that door. Don't have to tell me twice. You should be able to get out that way. Hurry. Dude, can you even hear us? Don't worry. I'm picking up everyone's voices. Just go, Joker. Hmm? Wait a sec. What the? I'm getting a weird reading heading your way. Come on, run! Don't gotta tell me twice. Again. We got away from a bunch of those guys in black, but there's still loads more of them. Where'd they go, damn it? I can't confirm the intruder's location. Well, maybe if you bothered taking a quick look to your left, you'd have seen us. Huh? Up ahead. Stop! This is bad. Hide, Joker! You'll never get away if you just keep fighting. Hide in the shadows and sneak past when you see an opening. Hey, are you sure you came in this way? Understood. I will continue the search. Should have been a little more patient and observant. Now's your chance. Make a run for it. How many of them are there? Hmm. Everything okay? The security level might rise if you take too much time. I know, I know. I'm looking for another route. Just hang on. Oh, perfect timing. Joker, look up. Can you use that thing and just fly over there? Ah, yes. One of the first new changes from Persona 5. The grappling hook. A tool every thief should have. All right, go straight from there. Oh yeah, because that doesn't look like a perfect ambush point. Joker, stop! It's an enemy right near you. Even you can't take on this many. Huh? Joker. 
Hungry. That weird reading from earlier is closing in on you, too. And who, pray tell, is this? I'll end this right now. Joker, it's her! She's the weird reading I've been getting! My weak self relied on you so much. That ends today. Let's do this, Senpai! Alrighty then. The enemy readings have decreased? That's... <laughs> it's been a while since we last fought side by side. But this time, it's my turn to come to your aid, Senpai. No. Now let's win this. Don't gotta tell me twice. Let's hit him with a brave blade. Sona. Beauty is devotion. I think that's the last of them? For now. I genuinely have no clue what just happened, but I take it you're okay? Wait, bad news. Enemy backup's headed your way. You need to book it right now. Please go. I'm going to make it harder for them to track you down. You still have something you need to do as a phantom thief, right? Then I won't stop you. Since I'm not a member of the Phantom Thieves, I'm in no position to interfere. However, please don't forget the promise we made, okay? Joker, you need to get out of there! Go, go, go! Hmm. A mysterious girl that we've made a connection right, with. Let's do it! Yet ha has the same power as us, yet is not part of our team. Interesting. Ugh, I try to play this off as not knowing anything, but really, I've I've played through this game multiple times. Go up the stairs at the end of the path, just a little more, so hang in there. He's not alone. Find them and kill them all. there that's just how it is after that commotion the bottom floor is completely closed off hey can you make it over there there's no way to run says you <laughs> see ya Suspect secure. 
Didn't expect to find some kid. You have your teammate to thank for this. You were sold out. Suspect confirmed. Cuff it. Guess the drug was too strong. Wake him up. No dozing off. You still don't get it, do you? Give it up! Come on, cooperate! What? You want another shot? Huh? What about the camera? Are you thinking it can be used as video evidence? Of course not. You're clearly corrupt cops. You're just gonna erase the footage. So, you're not that dumb. Which is good. Cause we get to take as much time as we need! Destruction of justice, blackmail, defamation, possession of weapons. Manslaughter too, yeah? Talk about the works. To think that all those crimes were led by a punk like this. And you seem to be enjoying every second of it. Huh? I was... enjoying it? Everything's hazy. I can't remember. For those who want balance between exciting gameplay and riveting story, you can change it at any time. Choice will not affect the story. The lower the difficulty, the more money and XP you get from enemies. Honestly, I'm just going to play on normal so I don't have to spend too much time grinding. That being said, there are some tricks I can use, but I won't be able to use them for some time. So the early parts of the game are not going to be easy. I'm certainly not playing Merciless. So, let's just stick with normal. You wish to begin the game with normal difficulty? Yes. You should know your place. Sign here. It's a confession under your name. I see. I need your hand to sign this, but... I don't care if you end up losing a leg. God, I wish I had an option to just spit in his face. Or to shove that pen don't in his eye. Don't expect to walk out of here in one piece. We are going to make you understand. One must take full responsibility for their actions. Oh, well, that's rich coming from you. Now, normally I'd be going with what I view as the canonical name as Akira Kurusu. Instead, I'm going to be going for something different. Uh, 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 Juru. Nakamura. Anybody who gets the reference is a person of fine taste. Juru Nakamura. That is my name. Excuse me, but this area is off. I'm Nijima from the public prosecutor's office. The prosecutor's office? What business do you have here? Just let me through. It's urgent. There's something I need to confirm with the suspect. Nijima-san, 
I believe this case is no longer in your jurisdiction. Besides... Are you Prosecutor Sai Nijima? I just got off the phone with your director. Hurry and get it over with. To be frank, you're being an inconvenience. <sighs> I thought I ordered you to stand by. I'm responsible for this case, yet I'm not even being allowed an interrogation? I'm calling because I knew you'd bring it up. I will not be convinced unless I confirm it for myself. This is my case. Uh, good luck to you then. I won't be expecting much though. Ah, Prosecutor, I forgot to mention something important. Your time will be cut short. We can't permit you to talk with him for long. <sighs> it's for your own sake. His methods are unknown, after all. We don't even know if it's safe to simply meet and speak with him. I understand. I didn't expect it'd be you. You'll be answering my questions this time. <sighs> Those bastards. Can you hear me? It seems you've been through a lot. Almost anything can happen here. And I can't stop them. That's why I need you to answer me honestly. I don't have much time either. What was your objective? Why did you cause such a major incident? I didn't think it was a prank from the get-go, but I couldn't assemble a case for prosecution. It's because I couldn't figure out the method behind it. Of course you couldn't. <laughs> True. There's no way I could be convinced of such a world just by reading the reports. It seems you're coherent. When and where did you find out about that world? How is it even possible to steal another's heart? Now, tell me your account of everything. Start from the very beginning. Yep. This story is called is told. Is told in Medias Res. Sorry, I had to remember the uh, pronunciation you of it. Are held captive, a prisoner of fate to a future that has been sealed in advance. This is truly an unjust game. Your chances of winning are almost none. But if my voice is reaching you, there may yet be a possibility open to you. I beg you, please overcome this game and save the world. The key to victory lies within the memories of your bonds, the truth that you and your friends grasped. It all began that day, when the game was started half a year ago. For the sake of your world's future, as well as your own, you must remember. Now then, as you can see, we have choices of our, uh, dial in dialogue at times. They're not always important, but sometimes they are. I'll let you know when they are. And yes, a save system. I love it when games have a manual save system. Especially when I'm doing Let's Plays of them. But yeah, half an hour in and we've only gotten pseudo-tutorial plays throughs? Eh, not even really that.
that's what's going on. Alrighty then, back in control of our character. Looking less impressive than he did in that casino. If you're ever confused about what to do or where to go, look to the upper right corner of the screen to view various hints. Yeah, get used to seeing these tutorials a lot. Seriously, the first few hours of the game are heavily tutorialized and really, really slows down the game. But that's a Persona game for ya. It's usually a few hours before you get to actual meat, because there's a lot of story building to get to. Head to your new lodging. Exit the subway station. No one's been taking responsibility. It's a waste. Waste of what? Starting today, Sojuro Sakura will be taking care of me. His house should be in the back streets of this residential area. I do love that I can toggle auto. Uh, auto playing on the dialogue on and off. Turn it on when they're actually talking, turn it off when they're not so you can actually read through the dialogue. Something I would have really liked back in Golden. So yeah, use your R, rotate the camera, press B, yada yada. Basic controls. Talking to people, all sorts of people live in the city. Try listening to their conversations or press A to talk to them. You might learn something new. I think I need to up the... Let's see... System settings... Yeah, let's go for that. Turn it up a little bit. There we are. What was that? I want to ask for directions. Hmm? You want to get to the residence at that address? It's in an alley a bit further back. Take a right after that apartment with the stairs. Thank you. Uh-oh. Ugh. How funny that I sneeze as I'm talking to a sick man. <sighs> What'll I do? I'm feeling under the weather, but I've got an important meeting tomorrow. I thought I'd give this place a shot, but they said they were closed for the day. And it's still er so early, too. I just can't believe it. Maybe I should go in and ask again. Hmm? Okay. Was there another, um, a accident? I see a policeman over there. Oh, he's just watching to make sure everyone's safe. It'd be scary if something like that happened again, though. Let's hurry home. See, the nameplate here says Sakura. It looks like this might be Sojo Sakura's house. Mm. Even after ringing the doorbell, it doesn't look like anyone will answer the door. Maybe he's gone out? Looks like no one's home. Oh, yeah. Sakura san's usually at his cafe around this time. Well, it belongs in the back alley, so I should make my other deliveries first. Hmm. Next, I need to take this package to... So, he's at his cafe, and mm. conveniently, on the map, there happens to be a little coffee cup. Holy crap. Ah, uh, one second, I'm getting a phone call. Okay, we're back. Sorry about that. Anyways, well, he's unfriendly, but let's talk to him again, see if he says anything different. You again? What is it? Where's LeBlanc? LeBlanc? All right, that cafe. It's in an alley past the tobacco shop here. There's no time for that. 
Uh, it looks like this is this place is LeBlanc. Let's go inside. A public transit bus was driven down an opposing lane with its customers still in it. The citizens can't live in peace if this keeps up. Oh, oh how frightening. What could be going on? Didn't something similar happen just the other day? And down is uh, the name of a shellfish used in pearl farming. Oyster? Oh, right. They did say that was today. Well, we'll be going now. The payment's on the table. Thanks for coming. Uh, this place is in the back alley, so there's no worries of a car crashing in here. A what now? There's been a string of those rampage accidents, you know. I just hope that none happen around here. None of my concern. <laughs> well, see you next time. Oh, four hours for just a single cup of joe. So, you're the guy. Please take care of me. Uh-huh. I'm Sojiro Sakura. You'll be in my custody over the next year. I was wondering what kind of unruly kid would show up. But you're the one, huh? Have you been told? A customer of mine and your parents know each other, and... Well, not that that matters. Follow me. Yeah, it was a little bit out there that he would just take us in like this that. This is your room. I'll at least give you sheets for your bed. You look like you want to say something. It's big. It's on you to clean up the rest. I'll be leaving after I lock up each day. You'll be alone at night, but don't do anything stupid. I'll throw you out if you cause any trouble. Now then. I got the gist of your situation. You protected some woman from a man forcing himself on her. He got injured, then sued you, right? That's what you get for sticking your nose in a matter between two adults. You did injure him, yeah? And now that you've got a criminal record, you were expelled from your high school. The courts ordered you to transfer and move out here, which your parents also approved. In other words, they got rid of you for being a pain in the ass. It's best you not talk about anything unnecessary. I am in the restaurant business, you know. Behave yourself for the year. If nothing happens, your probation will be lifted. Whole year. Cause any problems and you'll be sent straight to Juvie. We'll be going to Shujin tomorrow. Shujin? Shujin Academy. The school you'll be attending. We'll introduce ourselves properly to the staff there. There's rarely a place that'll accept someone like you, you know? <laughs> what a waste of my Sunday. Your luggage arrived a little while ago. I brought it up here for you. I'll be living here starting today. Let's check out what's in here. It's the cardboard box sent from back home. It's full of clothes and daily necessities. I'll change into more comfortable clothes for now. Guess I should clean up the room while I'm organizing things. Yeah, probably should. There are all these unused household items lying here. It's not organized at all. Some parts of these shelves must have rust on them. Uh, have rust on them. All these difficult looking books are carelessly crammed in it. I should start cleaning first. He's not even a proper bed frame. It's late. It seems like I've been cleaning for a while. What the heck? I heard you making all sorts of noise up here, but I didn't think you were cleaning. Actually, the place doesn't look too bad. 
Though it's only natural you'd want to keep your room tidy. Why don't you go to bed for tonight? You don't have anything better to be doing, right? I'm going to close up shop and get out of here myself. I won't be the one looking after you if you get sick from staying up too late. You got that? Going to bed is a special action that will advance time. Time is limited, think carefully about your schedule before you react. Yeah, once we really get into the meat of the game and actually have a time limit to take care of things, as well as have to make serious decisions based upon what it is we are going to do for the day, I am in fact going to be using a um, guide for this. There'll be a uh, link to it in the description below the video. Because I want to see, well, pretty much everything available. But, for the time being, we're pretty much going to be railroaded into everything. Starting today, this is my room. Change and go to sleep. Arrest, trial, criminal record. Damn brat! I'll sue! Still, I couldn't just let that go. <sighs> that day. Ended up going home late. Just get in the car. Hmm? I can hear a man and a woman arguing in the distance. I think they're just up ahead. How dare you. Don't give me that shit. Looks like that drunk man is bothering that woman. Ow! Please stop! She's in danger. I can't ignore this. What a waste of time. You think you're worth causing me trouble? Huh? I'll, I'll call the police! Call them if you want. The police are my bitches. They're not gonna take you seriously. No! Stop! Someone called the cops, huh? Get in the car! Incompetent fools like you just need to shut your mouths and follow where I steer this country. What are you looking at? Get out of my face! This ain't a show. Get lost, kid. See? This is all because you're so damn slow. Get in the car! Hmm? It's that weird app that somehow ended up on my phone. Icon almost looks like an eye. It looks almost like an eye. Thought I deleted it. My eyelids are starting to get heavy. Trickster, welcome to my velvet room. So you've come 
too, inmate. <gasps> the you in reality is currently fast asleep. You are only experiencing this as a dream. You're in the presence of our master. Stand up straight. Welcome. I am delighted to make your acquaintance. This place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. It is a room that only those who are bound by a contract may enter. I am Igor, the master of this place. By the way, if it sounds like his voice is rather crackly, that's normal. It's not a problem with the recording. Remember it well. I summon- Huh. Even labels him as peculiar old man. Nice. Due to speak of important matters. It involves your life as well. Wait. I wonder what they got for... Mean-looking girl, quiet girl. Huh. It's funny, it's because if you never look at the log, you would never see that. Important matters. It's a nice touch. Still, this is a surprise. The state of this room reflects the state of your own heart. To think a prison would appear as such. You truly are a prisoner of fate. In the near future, there is no mistake that ruin awaits you. Ruin? I speak of the end to everything. However, there is a means to oppose such a fate. You must be rehabilitated, rehabilitated toward freedom. That is your only means to avoid ruin. Do you have the resolve to challenge the distortion of the world? I'd rather avoid ruin. Allow me to observe the path of your rehabilitation. Ah, pardon me for not introducing the others. To your right is Caroline. To your left, Justi. They serve as wardens here. Ha! Try and struggle as hard as you like! The duty of wardens is to protect inmates. We are also your collaborators. That is, if you remain obedient. I shall explain the roles of these two at another occasion. Now then, it seems the night is waning. It is almost time. Take your time to slowly come to understand this place. We will surely meet again, eventually. Time's up! Now hurry up and go back to sleep! I had a strange dream. Ruin? Rehabilitation? What does it mean? Looks like you're up. Well then, let's go introduce ourselves properly to the staff about your transfer. The school you're attending is in the Aoyama district. It'll take a while to get there by train. The transfers are a real hassle, too. I'll drive you there, but just for today. Let's go. Jeez, men aren't usually allowed in my passenger seat. Do me a favor and behave yourself, all right? Don't get me wrong. I don't care what happens to you. Just don't cause me any trouble. To reiterate, just so we're clear, you will immediately be expelled if you cause any problems. In my opinion, you're nothing but a liability. But we had our circumstances to consider. Whatever you might have gotten away with in your hometown, those days are over. If you are thrown out from our school, there will be no place for you to go. Keep that in mind. This is the teacher in charge of your class. I'm Sadayo Kawakami. Here's your student ID. Be sure to read the school rules. Any violations will send you straight to the guidance office. And if by chance you cause any problems, I won't be able to protect you at all. That is your promise, yes, Principal Kobayakawa? Mm-hmm. He is responsible for all his actions. But really, though, why me? There should have been better candidates. It was a sudden transfer, and your class was the only one that had an opening. If you're done explaining things, Mind if we get going? I got a store to get back to. Sakura-san, 
please keep a close eye on him. Don't let him cause any trouble outside. Well, I'll be sure to have a serious talk about the situation he's in. <sighs> Come to the faculty office when you arrive at school tomorrow. I'll show you to your classroom. Everyone's giving you the cold shoulder. That's what having a criminal record does to you. Turns out your past follows you wherever you go. By the way, if you get expelled now, I won't hesitate to kick you out. Got it? I'll be careful. Hmm. School never changes, huh? Come on, we're going home. What a troublesome situation. I can't believe they pushed someone with a record on me. A male teacher would be better suited for this. Why in the world was someone like that admitted here? Who knows? It was the principal's decision. I was told that it's for the school's reputation. I would have thought that my volleyball team has contributed more than enough to cover that. That's certainly true. Be careful, okay? Then again, if anything were to happen, I'd kick out a student like that right away. Well, I keep wishing that he'd just end up not coming to school. Still, that isn't something I should be saying as a teacher. Well, I should be returning to practice. Oh, right. The tournament's coming up, isn't it? <laughs> Having such high expectations placed on you by others is quite a problem in itself. We'll have to work hard to make up for the track team, too. Yes, that's true. Why'd it have to be my class? Not so subtle foreshadowing, if you know uh, this game. Traffic's not moving at all. You're taking the train starting tomorrow. So, how was it? The school, I mean. You think you can manage? It'll be tough. You brought it on yourself, though. Still, you were expelled once already. <laughs> to think you'd re-enroll at a different one. It's not like anyone will be sympathetic with you. If that's what it was like at school, people might say stuff about me in the future, too. What a troublesome kid I've taken in. Why did you take me in? I was asked to do it, and I just happened to agree to it. Uh, I've already been paid for it, too, after all. And now, back to today's top stories. A subway train has derailed, severely affecting the timetable across all of... Oh, another accident. So that's why it's so crowded. There's been a lot of those lately. In fact, there was a real sad one just last month. It happened before you came here. If I remember right, the girl that passed away was only 15. Her parents have got to be just... All traffic around Shibuya Station is being redirected due to the accident, so drivers should expect jam-packed streets. Oh, come on. That's terrifying. We're experiencing technical difficulties in the lower line. I don't have a visual yet. That was direct footage from the accident. According to the police, the engineer's life was not in danger despite his injuries. After questioning, even he could not explain his high speed when approaching the station. No further comments were made. Police are still looking for a plausible motive. It's less of an operating accident and more of a crime of the company and the government. Site inspectors apparently reported all of this six months ago. The deterioration of the tracks and the ATC. Seems a railway company and the Ministry of Transport both turned a blind eye to the truth. There's no way they can hide. This will go all the way to the top. Now on to our main story. With this derailment accident, 
as well as other recent incidents of unknown motive, concern is spreading among the general public. Just what could be causing such a drastic change so suddenly in these people? SNN has Everything's linked. That's what you're thinking, correct? Hmm. Oh, well. Are you free? You and I haven't gone for a drink in a while. Thank you, sir. But I have another meeting to attend. I must be going. I was I was ready to go for this meeting, and that's when this extremely fast train just came crashing in. Oh man, I thought I was gonna die. A noisy subway platform filled with people was suddenly. Did you ask for me? Is it a case? Not quite. I want your opinion on something. Sure. Your judgment is quite often correct, though. Can we discuss this over sushi, perhaps? You are making a student work late, after all. Conveyor belt only. Huh. Introducing us to yet more characters. <laughs> Damn, to think there'd be that much traffic. What a waste of time. I wasn't able to open the cafe today. Whatever. Just head upstairs. There's something I need to give to you. Talk about a gruesome accident. 80 people were involved. Here's a diary. Make sure you keep it up to date. You may be under probation. There's no special limitations on what you do in particular. Besides following the law, that is. However, I'm obligated to report on you, which is why I'm having you record your daily activities. Hey, what's up? I'm about to leave right now. Don't worry. I'll be there in no time. Uh -huh. <laughs> I'll see you soon. Well, I'm off. I'll lock the place up. So do whatever you want for the rest of the night. Oh, but don't mess up my store. If something goes missing, I'll hand you right over to the cops. You got school tomorrow. You better head off to bed, all right? Jeez, first he says do whatever you want, then he's saying go straight to bed. Make up your mind. I should do as I'm told for now. I should write down what happened in my diary today. You can save your game by pressing when you see the button command in the lower left. You can save at any time. Yay! No more being restricted to specific save points. I need to get up early tomorrow. I should get plenty of rest today. I should write something. And as a note, do not spend all your time saving in one save slot. Trust me, you are going to have multiple ones in case you screw something up in your schedule along the way. Anyways, not much else to do but go to bed. That ring sound isn't coming from my cell phone. I hear it coming from downstairs. Hey, it's me. Who is this? <laughs> Have you forgotten my voice already? It's Sakura. Anyway, I, I closed up shop, but I forgot to flip the sign to closed when I left. It's too much trouble for me to come back just for that. Think you can do it for me? Okay. I doubt any customers are going to come now, even if the signs flip to open. But I have to say, this is quite a relief. It's a personal policy of mine not to save a guy's number in my phone. I'm glad you actually picked up. Anyway, I'll leave the shop sign to you. All right. We could go wandering around, but honestly, there's not much of a point to it. All right, time to go to sleep. There are all these books stacked on the desk. I can't use this at all while it's like this. Anything else I need to do? Nope. Need to take the train to school. 
Yonginjaya, Aome, Ichitome, transfer. Looks like I need to go out to Shibuya, then transfer there. More news about the subway accident. It sounds like a lot of people were hurt. I bet this will affect the timetables for tomorrow, too. That strange app I saw last night is back. It keeps showing up. Thought I erased it. I should probably reboot my phone, just in case. My eyelids are starting to get heavy. I have school starting today. Hopefully I can get there without getting lost. I don't want to be late on my first day. I should head out now. So, you're actually going to school, huh? Here, I'll feed you. Just make sure you finish it before the customers start coming in. Curry? What's that reaction for? Just eat it. Hmm? Whoops. I can taste complex flavors within the bold spiciness. Thank goodness you can access the log at any time. It's time for you to go. Thanks for the meal. Turns out you do have manners after all. Hurry over to school. You'll end up late if you get lost on the way. Alright, time to get going. Oh, yeah, and flip the sign outside to open for me. Okay, got Don't it. Don't forget to do that for me, alright? Now, you better hurry on out. You're gonna be late if you get lost, country boy. Alright, better get moving. We can either head down further down the alleyway or up this way to get to the uh subway. Doesn't matter either way. Up on the train, which thankfully showed up right on time. There's so many people crammed into this tiny car. Turns out the rumors about the Tokyo subway are true. I'm showing the news on the L C D screen. It seems like there are still some lingering effects of yesterday's accident. Shibuya. This is Shibuya. Okay. Go to the Ginza line. Which way is that? Why is it late again? The accident was yesterday. Our apologies. However, it was a major accident, and this isn't the first time this happened. Why weren't you better prepared for this one? Sheesh. Right. Well, towards the Ginza line. There's no mention of the Ginza line on the sign up there. I should look elsewhere. Central Street? This way ahead looks like it connects to Central Street. Oh yeah, did you hear? Ginza line is apparently this way. As we just phase through people. Gel transfer onto the Ginza line. Ah. Sign says they're cleaning the area right now. I should probably look for a way around. Coming to you live from Shibuya Station. The cause of yesterday's subway derailment has affected all transportation lines. The string of accidents has put commuters on high alert. Mm -hmm. Trains are off schedule today because of the subway accident yesterday. For the jail line, go to the ticket gate, passed here on the left hand side. For the subways, go to the underground district from the central stairs. For the Ginza line, climb the stairs to the Tekyu building next door. There we go. That's absurd. Who cares? 
And this way to the Ginza line. Oh, man. Did it say it was going to rain today? Huh? It's raining outside? It just started all of a sudden. This is why I hate the early spring. That reminds me. Did he take an umbrella? Hmm? Who are you talking about? <laughs> Don't mind me. So, what'll it be? One house blend, please. The effects of yesterday's subway accident continues on today, as various lines suffer delays and... There's been a lot of nasty accidents lately. You know, I mean the subway accident that the news is talking about. My coworker got caught up in it and is in the hospital now. But that aside, it's kind of creepy. The people who caused these accidents supposedly went crazy all of a sudden. I heard that some of them suffered from nervous breakdowns during interrogation. Huh. Zayama Ichitomi. And yes, I know, I just butchered that. Despite them immediately telling me, but whatever. It took some time, but I finally made it. Hmm? There was another one of those strange accidents. This time it happened on a subway. If it weren't a Sunday, I might have been on it. That's really scary. How much longer do you think this sort of thing will happen? Morning. You want me to give you a ride to school? You're gonna be late. Um, sure. Thank you. Do you need a lift too? Huh? Nah. What do you want? You planning on ratting me out to Kamoshida? Kamoshida? Huh? In that car just now, it was Kamoshida. He does whatever the hell he wants. Who does he think he is, the king of a castle? Don't you agree? King of a castle? No, I, I mean... Hmm? Wait. You don't know Kamoshida? <laughs> you for real? You're from Shujin, right? You got a Shujin too? What? No other high school's got a uniform like this. Huh. A second year, huh? We're the same grade then. Never seen you before, though. Oh. You a transfer student? <laughs> then no wonder you don't know him. This rain ain't too bad. We better hurry up or we'll be late. Ah. Feel lightheaded for some reason. Damn it. I wanna go. Ugh. Oh, my head hurts. Damn it. I wanna go home. Go home.
There was a terrible subway accident that day. You remember it, don't you? I assume you know of the uproar that the public calls the psychotic breakdown incidents. I might. And yeah, get used to the, the game flashing forward to this interrogation several times throughout the game. I might. You say that like it's none of your business. It was all over the news, and one of the victims included a teacher at your high school. I've no doubt you heard about it. On that day, were you still an ordinary student? What do you mean? Let me change the question. You transferred to Shujin Academy, correct? An ordinary prep school that could be found in any city. That's what it should have been. What happened around that time? Tell me everything, truthfully. the school uh did we make a wrong turn N no this has to be it i mean it should be out of service where do we end up the sign was for the school right yeah right you saw it too Jeez, you freaked me out. Who are you? You a student? Man, your costume's impressive. Is that armor real? Come on, don't just stand there, say something. Hey, what's going on? Uh, this must be a prank. You really think so? This shit's real. Calm down! It's time out, man! We gotta run! Got it. Stop standing around and run! Yeah. What's with these guys? You're gonna break my bones, damn it! The hell you think you're yeah? Take them away! Time to save again. Hey, 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 wake up. You all right? Uh, yep, you. Yeah. More or less. Looks like this ain't no dream. Yeah, what's going on? Hey, let us out of here. I know there's someone out there. Damn it. Where are we? Is this some kind of movie set?
the hell was that just now? Whoa, 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 whoa! You're shitting me, right? Come on, man. This is real bad. Isn't there some way out of here? Come on, we gotta do something. Hey. Yo, there's nothing in there. Uh... Hey, those chains are used for, like, torturing and stuff, right? Damn it, this shit ain't funny. Hmm. Much time's passed since we got knocked out. Damn it, this don't make any freaking sense. Huh? Huh? You hear that? Be glad that your punishment has been decided upon. Your charge is unlawful entry. Thus, you will be sentenced to death. Say what? No one's allowed to do as they please in my castle. Huh? Wait, is that you, Kamoshida? Kamoshida? I thought it was some petty thief, but to think it'd be you, Sakamoto. Are you trying to disobey me again? It looks like you haven't learned your lesson at all, huh? And you brought a friend this time. Because you can't do anything for yourself. This ain't funny, you asshole! Is that how you speak to a king? It seems you don't understand the position you're in at all. Not only did you sneak into my castle, you committed the crime of insulting me, the king! The punishment for that is death. It's time for an execution! Take him out! Stop it! Damn it! I ain't down for this shit. Come on, we're out of here. Just go. Get out of here. These guys are serious. Uh oh, running away, are we? What a heartless friend you are. He ain't a friend. Come on, hurry up and go! What's the matter? Too scared to run away? <laughs> Pathetic scum isn't worth my time. I'll focus on this one's execution. Take this! Lily scum! Useless pest! Where'd your energy from earlier go? A peasant like you isn't worth beating. I'll have you killed right now. Stop it! Hmm. Why? Don't you dare tell me you don't know who I am. That just a your eyes irritates me. Just a creep. Hold him there. After the peasant, it's his turn to die. No. No, I don't want to die! <laughs> this is truly an unjust game. Your chances of winning are almost none. But if my voice is reaching you, there may yet be a possibility open to you. What's the matter? Are you simply going to watch? Are you forsaking him to save yourself? Death awaits him if you do nothing. Was your previous decision a mistake then? It wasn't. Very well. I have heeded your resolve. That's enough! What? 
was that? You desire to be killed that much? Fine. of twilight our sense what the i am the rebel soul that resides within you if you so desire i shall consider granting you the power to break through this crisis give me your power hmm. very well who the hell are you Guards! Start by killing that one! You'll learn the true strength of my men! Well, if they're anything like you, it'll be nothing. This power of mine is yours! Kill them however you want. Run wild to your heart's content! All right. Normally in the original game, he'd force you to use certain attacks or certain actions. But for us, we have order, change tactics, which does nothing for us right now. I don't even know why it's an option there. We got items, which we have none, but we can gain more later on. We can guard to defend ourselves, reducing damage from enemy attacks. We can use a basic attack from our melee weapon, which as you can see is that little knife right there, or... We can call upon our persona, our Sen, to attack them with magical or later on physical attacks. Crypt Dwelling Pyromaniacs. Well, I'm not going to go over their stats and other things just yet. The uh, game will cover that for me. And from that battle, we gain experience and money. Money, especially in the early game, is going to be very, very, very important for us. Hey, and we gained a level All up. Right. Level up. That increases our max HP and max SP, which is basically our magic points. But leveling up does not refresh your stats, unfortunately. And as you can see, our persona also has separate levels. What? And we have gained the achievement Spirit of Rebellion. What was that just now? Obtained our sen. You little. Ha! You like that, you son of a bitch? Lock the cell. Y you mean this? Okay, it's locked. Damn you! Hey, what was that just now? And your clothes? Whoa, it went back to normal. You bastards! God, this is effing nuts. 
Anyways, let's scram. You lead the way. Goddamn thieves! After them! Don't let them escape! Probably should have held on to those keys. Damn you! Y you bastards! You think you can get away with doing this to me? What was that? I don't give a shit. I ain't down for any of this. Come on, let's get out of here. I All mean... Right. Seems like we're getting away with it pretty well. Come on, we gotta look for a way out of here. Yeah. Alright, we can keep going this way. And just gotta keep moving. Hmm? What's up? Hmm? What's up? Yeesh, can we really get across this? On the other hand, there's nowhere else we can try. Alright, let's get to hopping. You can perform at certain locations in the palace, which is probably something they should have mentioned back at the broken bridge. If you move around while holding A down, you can perform these actions continuously. Whoa. Dude, you better not fall. I didn't. All that execution shit. Is he serious? Damn it. Won't open. Need some kind of exit. Is there some other path we can use? <sighs> no. Another cell? Whoa! Crap, my bag's stuck. Better get it unstuck. Hey, hold up. Damn it. Look, there's some guys in armor over there. They'll probably call for backup if we try and take them on. We should go some other way. Hey, you're not gonna hear me argue staying away from them. Oh. Is this a drawbridge? And again. Dude, the hell is this place? Whoa! Hey, we gotta hide. Over there. They're looking for us, right? I ain't playing along with this anymore. We gotta find a way out of this goddamn place. You don't say. <laughs> this goes up. You think it heads to the exit? Or we could be in a tower and it's leading us further upwards. Then again, the river probably indicates we're below ground or at least ground level. <laughs> Is this the exit? Hey, let's get the hell out of this place. Dude, you gotta be joking. This ain't the exit. What the hell is this place? Yeah, there ain't a whole lot we can do in here right now, because we're a bit railroaded. Huh? Hey, look. So we really did hear people screaming. So we ain't the only ones who got captured. Is, uh, is he okay? Does he look okay? Do any of them? Huh? Something up there. Bridge and a statue? Damn it. Shit, this bridge is raised up. Ain't there some way to lower it? What the hell? Another dead end? Damn it, how the hell are we supposed to get out of here? Hey! You there. Hey! Blondie, frizzy hair, look over here. What, what is, is this, this thing? thing? Hmm? You're not soldiers of this castle, right? Get me out of here! Look, the key's right there! We're trying to get the hell out of here. I mean, you obviously look like an enemy too. I'm locked up here, so how can I be your enemy? Help me out! A cat? I am not a cat! Say that again and I'll make you regret it! up already shit there's still no service ain't there any way to contact someone outside how the hell do we get out hey you two want to know where the exit is let me out and I'll take you there you don't want to get caught and executed right yeah, can you really help us I never go back on my word this thing sounds like it's all talk if you guys think you can get out on your own, then be my guest. What do we do? Are you seriously not messing with us? If you don't hurry, they'll catch you. 
fine. Uh, ah, freedom tastes so great. Now where's the exit, you monster cat? Don't call me a cat. I am Morgana. Shut up and hurry it up. You want to be locked up again? Oh, all right, sheesh. Follow me and stay quiet. It's fourth period already. Sakura-san said that he left the house this morning. Should I contact the police? No, that'll just be more of a hassle. What did I do to deserve this? Well, guess we just gotta follow it. What are you doing? What does it look like I'm doing? I'm lowering the bridge. You, frizzy hair. It seems like you pick up on things faster than our blondie over here. Try checking around the mouth of this statue, okay? How were we supposed to know to do that? <sighs> Amateur. Come on, let's keep going. <laughs> Oh, shit! Oh, shit, it's them! You amateur! Stay still! Hey, you! You can fight, right? Let's go! Come! You got one of those things, too? We will promptly shut them up! Damn shadows. They've taken up intercept positions. Looks like it's not about capturing us anymore. They're out for blood. I'll back you up. So fight like your life depends on it. Let's go. Okay, then. We have the Bedside Brute, and we have the Crypt Dwelling Pyromaniac. At this point, I'm going to go over their weaknesses, stats, whatnot. Crypt Dwelling, Crypt Dwelling Pyromaniac, 100 HP, 66 MP. Not that it really matters. It absorbs fire-based attacks, because there are other elements, so uh, for example, Aha is curse-based damage. It is, however, weak to ice and wind, neither of which our character has. We also have the Bedside Brute. Honestly, I, I'm not even going to bother with HP and MP on these guys. Weak to fire, resists electricity, and is weak to bless. Neither of which we which we do not have. As a matter of fact, none of those Let's we go. have. So we're better off just trying to attack one. Go down. Hm. I knew you were an amateur. This is how you fight. Zoro, show your might. Strike at an enemy's weakness to knock them down. Use that opening to strike again. Yeah, whenever you hit enemies with their weakness, they get knocked down and are temporarily out of the fight. If it gets back to their turn, they'll get back up and attack. So you don't want to give them the chance. But striking at their weakness grants you an extra turn. That's the most basic of basics. Remember it well. Skills have varying affinities and each enemy is weak to certain affinities. If you attack an enemy's weakness, you will deal more damage and knock them down. You're able to do, you will be able to take another action after knocking an enemy down. This is called a one more. If you then topple another enemy, you will gain another one more. This will continue as long as you continue to attack enemy weaknesses. Come on, let's hurry and get through this. Yeah, especially considering I've just ran out of time. See what I mean? Shouldn't have attacked us. More XP and more money. Now, we don't have any control over Morgana, as that has illustrated. That will change. Eventually. But we both leveled up, as did our Sen. You're evolving as a thief. And we gained the new skill, Cleave. Light physical damage to one foe. Now, as you can see, that has a cost of 7 HP. Whereas Aha cost SP. Magical skills cost you SP, while physical skills will cost you HP. Remember that, because if you're not careful, you could end up very low on health. 
without realizing it. You can also take a look at what the next skill you're going to learn is Secunda, decreases accuracy, slash evasion for one foe for three turns. Oh. Not bad. Your persona's pretty powerful. Persona? You mean that thing that comes out of you guys all dramatic-like? Yes, you saw how Frizzy Hair ripped off his mask when he summoned it, right? Well, everybody wears a mask deep within their hearts. By removing that... Whoa. Huh? He turned back to normal. Hmm. Looks like you don't have full control over your power yet. The transformation shouldn't normally dissolve like that. After all... Uh... Oh, that's enough. This crap doesn't make any sense. Can't you just sit still and listen for once, Blondie? Don't call me Blondie. My name's Ryuji. Hey. Actually, there's no time for me to lecture you. You want to escape this place in one piece, right? Let's go. Oh, but before that, take these. Use them carefully, okay? Edison. Okay. Could be useful. Come on, we should hurry. It's not much farther to the exit. It's not. However, just make sure you're going to HP okay. There's a chance we'll end up having to fight in here. You can check your stats, yes, by using the Y, head to skills, items, can be used from this menu. Right. But, with that, we are out of time for this episode, so I'm going to have to end things off there for today. If you guys like what you see, please leave a like, subscribe for future content, don't forget to hit that bell icon to get notifications for an upload, or, and please leave a comment down below this video. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thanks for watching.